Speaking to women. And I'm, and I'm judging. And look at that. To the new four horses. I take issue with that band name. Because neurotic is someone with too many uncontrollable emotions mm -hmm. and anxiety. But it's machinery, which means it doesn't have emotions or anxiety. So, make up your mind. Have you ever had, like, one of those errors where just all sorts of pop-ups start flashing on your screen and then it does <laughs> And then you get a blue screen? I beg to differ. I don't think it's the machinery that's neurotic. I think there's just something going wrong with the systems and your response to it is neurotic. Right, so these guys reached out to us and they requested we react to their song Insanity. And they are a band who chose one genre, which is something I'm not a big fan of usually. Unless that genre is tech death. And it's insane. So they're also tech. They're also what? Tech. Gent. Czech. Yes. Oh. Is it from the Czech Republic? Oh! You see, I'm not good with words sometimes. Uh, so, I expect insanity to be quite insane, which means I'm hot. Are you ready? No. Oh, girl. 
That was four minutes? Felt like a lot longer because a lot of things happened. Felt like a lot shorter at the same time because it was so fast. Yes. <laughs> so we can fairly conclude that he's having an easy thing. Which is accurate. <laughs> I really like that shit. This was amazing. It was so gnarly. I don't know a lot of tech death bands that are so easy to follow on a, on a first listen. It's so immediately engaging. You call that easy to follow? Yes. Easy to follow and engaging are not the same thing. Okay, it was very engaging. It was not easy to follow. It changed all the time. I feel I feel like it changed a lot between like really fast stuff and then really groove stuff. Yeah. And breakdowns. But I think they have a way of teaching their listeners temporal mathematics. Because they can show you that they keep the same tempo between the slow stuff and the fast stuff. Because they drop into one of those drops. Yes. And you start handbanging and it's like, it's so slow and gnarly and ugh. You know? Yeah. And, and you're into that. And you're not perceiving that as being a fast thing. Mm -hmm. And then in that riff, keeping the same riff, keeping the same pattern, the pedals kick. Yeah. And then on top of the pedals, the blasting kick. I love that. I love that sort of, the, that sort of slow, slamming riff with a machine gun in parallel. Yeah. That's, that's an incredibly cool effect and they're, they're placing it spectacularly well in this song. I also love the way it was shot. And I mean shot as in film, not actually shot, although it does feel like I've got shot after listening to it. Um, because you have this effect of silhouettes against the light, and when the silhouettes are doing the headbangs, that's fascinating to watch. Yes. Also, there was one moment I have to point out, where it was like, went into blast beat, kept it one bar, stopped, did some dynamic thingy thing, whatever, went into another blast beat, same pattern, but the guitar switched to melody. It was like, the difference between how those two bars of blasting felt, just a few seconds apart, was so massive. And that, that guitar that came in there that was kind of wailing was the only thing that was different. I was, that stuck with me the most from the whole song. You're out of your damn mind if I have any idea what you're talking about. <laughs> like there were so many things happening, you want me to stop one transition? No, but maybe they will. Or we can, like, go back to the song and listen to it multiple times and identify the timestamp. If I'm gonna listen to this song again, I'll be doing it alone. No bromancing. No, no bromancing. Are we done here? I just wanna say one more thing. Yes, there were clean bits in there and they were cool. That's it, I'm done. Clean bits? Yes, there were a few. You mean clean guitar or clean vocals? I mean, clean guitar. I mean, I'm not sure if it was clean, but there were like ambient of it. Okay, because I didn't hear clean vocal then. You kind of... No, not clean vocal, clean guitars. Yeah, the clean bits were cool. Because they give more of the tech that atmospheric edge, which is part of what's cool about tech that. Yes. So if you enjoyed this reaction, we greatly appreciate the likes and shares. And if you want more, don't forget to subscribe with bells. Thank you very much for stopping by. We hope you enjoyed your stay, and we'd love to see you back at the window very soon. Cross it out.